Welcome back to my channel, Smoking and Grilling. And today we're getting ready to make garlic butter scallops. As you can see, I put a post up here and the post was in my community tab, just asking everybody, have they even had scallops? Do you know what scallops are? And if you had them, what do they taste like? Do they taste like lobster? Do they taste like uh, shrimp or whatever? And you can see, you know what? I've got like a lot of people that got involved with it. A lot of thumbs up. People like the picture waiting on the video. And then you know what? A lot of uh, answers as you can see. What I'm gonna show you is, listen, we finna take the mystery out of that because most of the time we see it, it's always like on a, a menu. It's usually at like a, a upper scale, you know, a restaurant. I just wanna let you guys know this is so easy. Listen, if you know how to make shrimp, you know how to make these. And with that crust, they get a little glaze of sweetness. I don't know, it's that cooking process that put that, when you put it in your mouth, boom, you get that explosion. You know what I mean? So listen, I don't wanna over talk it. We already took the mystery out. I'm here to show you just how easy it is to make butter garlic scallops. Now in this video right here, in this recipe, you wanna talk about simple. Really all you're gonna need is salt, pepper, which would be fresh ground pepper, and then, you know, garlic and butter. Very, very easy to uh, use. And if you guys check in the description box below this video, I have the, you know, the quantities and everything in there. So what I did was I just started seasoning. That was kosher salt, by the way. I went ahead and just seasoned everything, you know, hit it with the salt. Then I came back with the fresh ground pepper. Look, as I turn it over, I'm thinking to myself, because it's really cooking so you can serve everything hot is about multitasking. So after I got them turned over and before I seasoned, I went ahead and put my pan on medium high heat. And as you can see right there, at 330 degrees in between that, 330 degrees and 375 degrees. Go ahead and melt your butter. And then what you do is you just repeat. Hit it with your kosher salt and the black pepper. Now listen, the black pepper gonna turn, you know, black inside of the uh, inside of your pan, but don't worry, that's not burned or nothing like that. It just gives it like a, a great flavor. It puts a crust on these scallops, and that's it right here. Now the first batch I made, as you can see, first batch, I didn't even use the gar uh, garlic. You know what, I wanted to make a batch by themselves. You can do it this way also. These are like super good. And then if you would like, I like to like mine to have a lot of butter in there. It just helps it, you know, with the caramelization with the uh with the, with the scallops and that black pepper. Man, there's something about that that just turns them like a nice sweet. I can't explain it. If you had them, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Then you know what? I just set these out here. This was batch number one. And then all you're doing is just see me, you know, set these back on here just for presentation, just to show you guys, you know, what they should look like. You can see the color and all of that. Now with that same butter and that same seasoned butter, I went ahead and added that. I went ahead and added that garlic to it, that minced garlic, and just stirred it around and got it nice and hot. You know what? And then you go ahead and just repeat. You want to put them inside of your uh, skillet. That's enough butter in there. You know what I mean? And we're just going to cook them. Now, listen, we're going to cook these for about one and a half to two and a half minutes on each side. And as you can see, you can see it's starting to form that crust from that fresh ground pepper. That right there is what we're looking for. Then, right here off to the side, you see I just cut some uh, lemon wedges. Now, you can do this two ways. You can go ahead and squeeze yours over the top as they're cooking, or you can just, you know, put them on a plate and then splash them. You can do it any kind of way you like. There is no wrong way. You know, so just go ahead, add them like that, set them off to the side, and there you have it. And after you flip them, just, you know, flip them twice just so that they can absorb some of that, you know, fresh squeezed lemons. There you have it right there. Butter garlic scallops. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and just seen, I hope I was able to just show you guys just how easy it is to make. Truly, when you talk about taking a mystery out, I guess the hard part is just actually purchasing the scallops. And once you got the scallops, you know what, it's just so easy to make. Just treat them like shrimp. Make sure that when you watch, you know, when you're cooking them and you're watching the heat rise, you know what? Once they become a little bit of that white, like translucent color, flip them over, hit them with your uh, lemon juice if that's what you want to do. I can just tell you this, listen, there is no wrong way. You know what, just put this in your repertoire. You just wanna change it up. You put this out with a little red wine. You are talking about changing it up. I just gave you guys the formula. Hey, with that being said, hey, if you guys are new to my channel, let me go ahead and just say, hey, welcome to my, to my channel. I hope you like what you saw. Don't forget to subscribe, smash that like button. And you know what, let everybody know, this is the channel here that's taking the mystery out of cooking. And what, say it with me, we simplifying their recipes. Hey, with that being said, you guys, I'm out.